It's a good question. Um, it's a very competitive market these days, right? So you have an overhang of, of capital um, and you have, I guess, an undersupply of interesting investments also in the technology space. Um, and so what happens is prices go up, as we've all seen, and this is a constant phenomenon that's been happening over the last 10 years, but more pronounced so over the last three or four years um, in, as the cycle has been ticking up. I guess there's two ways of addressing that as a, as a financial investor. One is to be just much smarter than anyone else. And that's in the context of a market where you tend to have very smart people to start with. Um, so that's a challenge. Um, or you specialize. And I guess what we at HG have been doing is to relentlessly focus and specialize over the last 15, 20 years. Ever since I joined um, that business 15 years ago, I helped build our technology practice and help build that focus of what we actually do in technology. So within the technology space, we only focus on software, we only focus on special business model within the software space. And that allows us to get up the learning curve faster than, than other people. And so when it then comes to evaluating a deal, I guess we come to the table with all that experience. So to give you an example, in the HR software space, um, over the last 13 years or so, since we started to invest in HR software, we've accounted for about 50% of the entire private equity market in Europe in terms of capital deployed. So we know all the assets, um, we know a lot of the history of the assets, and so I guess it allows us to price more accurately, but then more importantly it allows us to refine whatever management plan or other plan is, is at the table at the point in time.